that's how Iron Man started. Kind of. <laughs> What's up, Internet World? We're the News 19 Nerds. I'm Leroy. I am the Hunter. No, he's not. I am. I got my dual swords ready to fight up all the monsters. That's the only knowledge I have of Monster Hunter. I, I played it. I played the demo of Monster Hunter World, and it was cool, but it's not my cup of tea. So we're here to review <laughs> Pokemon Extra, because that's is? basically what I think Monster Hunter is. I didn't say that. <laughs> that. Don't come for me. You come for him. My at is uh, at Mo Patterson. <laughs> That's part of the name. So yeah, nice try. <laughs> but, um, Pokemon Extra, you say, huh? Yeah, I mean, you catch monsters and you kill them. You don't catch monsters. You kill monsters. You hunt monsters. It's in the title. You, you don't catch them. You hunt Pokemon. Uh, yeah, but you kind of put them in balls. You don't put these in balls. You, you, you kill them, take their innards, and make better armor. Hmm, cool. Yeah. And now you have a little cat friend with you. I dog would, friend I'm going to be honest with you. I was interested in this movie until I heard... Mila? Yeah. I like Mila Jovovich. Really? And it's not that I'm... I think she's a fine actress. I'm, really? I'm, I'm not saying she's the top of the game. That's not what I'm saying. Really? I think she commits whenever she does. And she is perfectly serviceable. Wow. Yeah. That's fine. This is a red box. <laughs> Fair enough. Um... I, you know what, you know, we always talk about me liking bad movies. I like the Resident Evil series. I like it once they go full ham. Did they do that from the first one? No. Oh. I when, like when, it, you, when do you feel like it went off the rails? Like four. Okay, sure. Like when, 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 past the desert. Okay. Yeah, like when they went crazy. Yeah. When Wesker showed up, I was and Ada Wong, I was like, yeah, give me all of this. Okay. When they when they went to the Russian sub base and under the under yes, the like that, that's what that's what I was like. Yeah, I like this. Okay. Well, um, fair enough. Yeah, I'm just not a real big fan of hers because I feel like her movies are just like she had so much promise. Fifth element, Fifth Element was just amazing. Um, the Joan of Arc movie, which she did with Luke Besson, was great. Um, I'm just, they've all, like, I, like, I hate to admit this. Uh-huh. I saw Ultraviolet in the movie theater. Yeah. Oh, uh, I wow. saw, I saw Eon Flux in the movie theater. Wow. I have supported this woman's career. Well, she wasn't in Eon Flux, though, right? Yes, she was. Who was she in Oh, no, my bad. That I was like, that's, that's Charlize that, Theron. That's Charlize Theron. Yeah, I was like, that's not the same My bad. Hey. All, all white women don't look alike. Yes. I'm sorry. Uh, man. <laughs> She was in something else that I that I saw in the theater. You know what she wasn't bad in that I actually liked her in? What? Hellboy. Oh, as the a witch queen, as a queen, yeah. yeah. I liked her. Okay. Um, I feel like that is where she shines. Okay. See, to me, I feel like she she knows what she does, and I think she she's fine in her role, and she doesn't mind being in a campy movie. Hence, being in six Resident Evil movies, um, and her her husband. Paul Anderson. Boo. Friend of the show. <laughs> You're right. I, he's another person that I think is okay because he knows what he's getting into. Those movies are campy. I unabashedly, unironically love the first Mortal Kombat movie. I watch it and I enjoy it. I know there are bad parts to it, but I, I love it. He directed but, that movie. Hold on. But you got also got to remember, mm -hmm. when you saw that movie, how old were you? Was it 95? So I would have been in fifth grade. Or see, they, they, see, another yeah. thing too is what we have to remember is sometimes a movie is bad and we know it's bad, mm -hmm. but it catches us at that that twilight of as we're coming of age. Sure. And so that we're it's a little bit of it is nostalgia. Okay. And we and we remember that feeling when we get when we watch something. I think Mila Djokovic is a is a good actress. Mm -hmm. However, comma. After watching uh, Charlize Theron. And now, granted, Eon Flux was was not great. It, it was not. But I will say this: after watching her and Atomic Blonde, uh -huh. and especially the Old Guard, uh -huh. whew, Charlize Theron, Mila, and and I and I feel like not just as far as like acting, like because you know she's a dramatic actress. So I'm talking just pound for pound as an action star, uh -huh. so much better. And I'm hoping this br allows her to be. The whimsical action person we saw in Fifth Element. Okay. Because I think she do, I think Mila does a better job when she's 
fighting, but there's a little bit of comedy. Because that's where I think at the end of the Resident Evil movies, mm -hmm. they she kind of got into the role that she was playing. Like it, it was over the top, mm -hmm. and it wasn't as serious as it was in the beginning. Okay. Great. So that that's that's my take. So and we also got Tony John in this movie somewhere. And he, he's the monster hunter. And T.I. T.I. is in this? Yes. I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, I hope he's in this trailer. Is he in the trailer? Do we know? I'm not gonna tell you. Oh man. Okay. Three, two, monsters. Hey, it's Bahama. Different game, sir. All monsters look alike. Serious, never Captain, mind. do you have any idea what those markers are? They look pretty ancient. The tracks in here. Definitely Bravo. Oh. They don't just disappear. Move, move, move! Watch out! Kind of. He took us somewhere. Making good. Oh, you know this is gonna be bad. Let's do that, guys. So what? Are we like Guardians of the Galaxy now? On our six. Yeah, bros. Above my pay grade. Is that showing you this guy? What those creatures are. We destroy them and close the gateway. Yes, I'm getting us all home. couple of movies with action with white women had just been outrageous my favorite one has been crawl because <laughs> crawl had you believing this olympic swimmer can take on modern dinosaurs i mean you said olympic she, she, she's top of her class sir 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 have you seen crawl i have seen crawl i enjoyed it very much i told you it was good i told hey, it didn't, was, I, didn't, was, didn't i tell you it was dumb but it was son good. Crawl. They need to make more movies like Crawl and sure. The Meg. Sure. Yeah. And I, you know what? I'll say Crawl was better than The Meg. I have to see Meg again. I've, I've, I've seen them. I mean, I won't fight you. I would, I would have to Let see Let me Meg tell you again. how good The Meg was, and I still haven't gotten her to watch it yet. Um, Crawl. I took Katie to see The Meg, and she liked it. Okay. Now I'm hoping one day when she's not paying attention, I'm gonna put Crawl on. Uh -huh. And then she'll just and she, she, it's, we in it now. Okay, cool. So you just passively passively abuse her eyes, sir. I sat through all the Harry Potter movies. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, not not counting uh, the, the Fantastic creator. Beast. No, I'm sorry, not counting the creator who made them. The movies are fine. Mm, yeah, okay. All right, you just being a hater, <laughs> being an anti just because. Uh, so what do we think of this? What we just what did saw? you think? I think it's fine. Oh, I mean, it, right? It's it's. You don't sound like. You don't sound convinced that this is gonna be. I think it's gonna be perfectly fine. I I never went into this because of who was involved, mm -hmm. Mila Jovovich and Paul Anderson. I was like, this will be a perfectly serviceable movie. So I'm so I'm not expecting this to be like, oh my gosh, this is yeah. this is this is gonna be the movie that gets video game movies right. I wasn't thinking that because okay. based on the track record, they didn't do it Resident Evil. They didn't do it Mortal Kombat. Whew. Again, Ooh. I think those movies are fine. I'm not looking at them like they're great. And we know we're getting a, a more a more modern version of Mortal Kombat. Uh, that I'm excited for, just because the people in it. Yeah. We'll see. Um, I like that Tony Jaw's in it. 
But if you put Tony John in a movie, I want to see him doing martial arts. Nah, homie. I don't need to see him wielding swords. I'm going to tell you right now. Tony, and bows and arrows. Tony John's just getting a check. I mean, I don't know. You know why? What? Look this up, guys. I'm warning you. Watch it at your own peril. Tony Ja, Nicolas Cage, Jiu Jitsu. Oh, you keep talking about that. I'm just I'm just, just that saying that. Tony Ja just collecting checks now. I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. Because Tony Ja, when you would say his name, you were like, "That's a standard." Mm -hmm. Now you say Tony Ja, I'm like, "Who else in it?" Wow. Yeah, okay. yeah, I said it. I All said right. it. Uh, did you see the one with him, Michael Jai White? And yeah, that's the one I told triple. you. What? Yeah, the, the triple front. Yeah, it whatever. was. Yeah. Remember, I was I was texting while I was watching. I was like, and you were like, yeah, you shouldn't have watched that one. Yeah, it's not. Because I yeah. like, and because when I when I see the name Tony Ja, and I see uh, what's the white dude that you were um, talking about? Scott um, Atkins. Scott Atkins. Yeah. Who I think would make a great Deathstroke, um, hmm. if we don't get um, uh, Joe Manganiello. Oh. I wonder if he's still going to be attached. To See, I think he's. I think they're still going to go through. I hope they do because I like Joe, um, and he's married to our friend of the show, Sophia Vergara. Uh, Put it I, in the air. Go ahead. What? I I feel like the trailer wasn't cut well. I did not like this trailer okay. because this is a problem I have with a lot of trailers. You they do this little pre thing in the beginning. Yeah. When we saw what was his name, uh, Rath Rathmonger, uh, um, uh, Pookie Bird, what what was the the, the Rathlos? dragon? Rathlos. Yeah. Rathlos monster. Whatever. Um, Rack. Uh, you said <laughs> what is it, Pookie Bird? Yes. <laughs> I hate you sometimes. <laughs> just because. <laughs> I'm just trolling you now. Pookie Bird. Um, mm. why would you show him at the beginning? Right. Like, that's a great reveal. Well, and it's the thing. We we know why they do it because all trailers now are cut in the social media vein of it's on your Instagram post. But see, that's... So that's why like, oh, that's why they, they want you to stop. See, and that's why I hate that because, one, you're giving away... Like, a trailer is, is, is a way to tell a story. For sure. And you don't start your story off that way. Now, I understand they're doing it for social media, but yeah, you, then you should cut an Instagram trailer and on YouTube yeah. or how, wherever else... Cut a whole like it doesn't take much, yeah. And because yeah. that was a great shot where the where where um, Rathalos grabs the wing and you see it like you could have started it mm -hmm. with that shot, then cut like the plane goes down and then do your little uh, 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 and then start with them driving in the Iron Man one scene in yeah. the desert. And shout out to, to to the people who are the Monster Hunter fans who are gonna come for us. We don't know the names of all these creatures. I assume that big one was a Rathalos. If it's not, y'all let us know. Look, I don't. I, I'm not even gonna profess. I played Monster Hunter one time. I thought it was pretty cool. Yeah. But it's it's one of those games where it's better with a bunch of people. For sure. And For I sure. don't like a lot of people. Yeah. So I play a lot of sync. So it's it's one of those games where because we talked about getting it. Yeah. Playing it and then like getting involved with it, but we just never got around to it. Right. Because um, it's like super cheap now or something. Yeah. yeah. Dude, that thing was like five bucks, yeah. brand new, sealed. Yeah. Um. I'm I'm actually interested in this movie, not because of the actors, but because I want to see the monsters. Okay. And one of the studios that's attached is Toho, mm -hmm. which I want to say they go back to like old Godzilla days. I'm pretty sure they're one of the, the Godzilla when I, studios. When I so look at cool. them, they look like the creature designs a little bit of the from um, Pacific Rim, and they look a little updated versions of some of the monsters you saw in King of Monsters and I and I got that feel from those monsters and I like that. Well I think some of those same studios are involved so that makes sense. So I like that. I'm um, not a real big fan of the actors and actresses at all. So Mila, Mila's gonna live because it's her movie. Yeah. Tony Jaws probably gonna live. Everybody else is gonna die? Probably. Ooh. Yeah, T.I., man. T.I. gone. Megan Good, Good gone. <laughs> I don't know now. Me Megan might make it. I don't know. You know what I think was gonna happen? What? So they would close the portal, mm -hmm. and like they, like the last scene of them closing the portal is gonna be like the ones who make it, and they're gonna be all in their gear and be like, we you know we can't go home, but we, you know we can close the portal, mm -hmm. and then they're gonna stay, and then they're gonna stand there, and they're like, I guess it's monster hunting time, and then the music, and then it's gonna end, yeah, and it's gonna be this new franchise. I mean, maybe I'm just. 
as say what you want about Paul Anderson, he knows how to make a franchise. Because people kept painting on Resident Evil, they made six of them. Yeah, so, but that's because they were cheap to make. That's what I'm. So what I'm saying is, the guy knows how to make a budget movie, and he he has some type of hook that appeals oh. to people like me to go see him. So if he can do the same thing with this, I don't know. Now, is it going to come to a movie theater? Eh. No. Eh. I don't no. want that. But no. Yeah. This is straight Amazon. <laughs> that that thing said 2020. In December. Yeah. Amazon December, just like coming to America. Oh, <laughs> yep. Because they we need a trailer for that. Oh, it's probably coming out pretty soon. Because yeah. they, they said they already got a date for coming to America too. Mm -hmm. Amazon bought it from uh, Paramount. Okay. So, I, I really this is one of those things where I'm be honest with you, on a Saturday afternoon, mm -hmm. not doing anything, lazy day. There's no no really good games on. I'd watch this. Okay. I, like a matinee, like yeah. Tuesday. I'd go see this. And I'm not hating on it. I just, I'm not a real big fan of Mila because I feel like that sh there's so much potential for her to be, again, where Charlize is. Mm -hmm. um, when you look at how good Charlize is in an action movie, dude, Mad Max is still like pound for pound one of the best action movies. Yeah, sure. In the last ten years, Old Guard was amazing, and even Old Guard was fun. Whoa, the act. I mean. The action scenes. Oh yeah, the, the choreography. Yeah, was, nice. it was, yeah. It was amazing. Yeah. Um, the, the plot, little, you know, if some of the two may be, hopefully be better. Yeah. Um, I feel like Mila could do that. Hell, I think Jennifer Lawrence isn't as good at action scenes as well as Mila is, but her movies are better. Yeah. So I just I feel like it's just it's like kind of like wasted potential. Okay. And um, so let us know yeah, what you think of this. What Josh Hellman, the guy who played Stryker. Mm -hmm. That's who we saw. Okay. Um, Megan Good is in this. And guess who else is in here? I don't know. I'm going to give you a guess. He was in Sons of An Anarchy. Oh, the main dude? I'm not going to tell you. you got to guess. I don't know. Is that the, the guy that's in King Arthur? Ron Perlman is in this. Oh, I did know that. because he's called. I the, did he, not. He's called the General, right? The Admiral. Close. The, the Admiral, something. I know he had wow. title. So, yeah, Good we job. haven't seen him yet. But, um, okay. I, I was not expecting T.I. to be in this movie. I am, I'm a little happier because T.I. is in it. I like this idea of T.I. creating this movie career. I, these little bit parts. I love him in Ant-Man. I think he's great in that role. Son, they need to do a Disney Plus show just with the four no, of them. Those guys? Good, because him, Michael Pena, and... Um, uh, I the guy know, with the accent who yes, doesn't really have the accent. David uh, Mess... Uh, Polka they, Dot Man, right? Yeah, yeah, whoever. Yeah, they are freaking hilarious. They are very good. Yeah, and I and they and I'm I wish he was the same person in this movie, like with the, like with the sayings and all. Yeah. that. Oh man. Yeah. Because I honestly, Ti is a pretty good actor. I I I, I enjoy him in the movies. Um, one of Ti's best roles was ATL. Okay. I, I I'm I'm going I'm I'm just saying and I. I I am going to say this, and it's going to be very controversial. T.I. may be a better actor than Ludacris. Hmm. Ooh, hot takes. I'm not Boom. bad at that. I, um... Huh. Yeah. <laughs> that, that doesn't upset me. That just makes me go, huh? It's, it's and, and when you think about some of the roles T.I. played, now granted, they play different roles, I think, I think because of T who T.I. is, mm -hmm. it's funnier when he does comedic takes. I get that. Versus Ludacris, who is always kind of jokey. He's an easygoing guy. Yeah. And, and so it's a different yeah. type of acting. I get that. But I, I really am liking T.I. as an actor. Yeah. Uh, Y'all let us know who's better, Ludacris or T.I. as an actor. T.I. I didn't ask you. I want the fans to let us know. Rubber band man. Also, y'all let us know if this, for the fans who are fans of Monster Hunter, let us know if this trailer hits you or not. Are you excited for the monsters yeah. that are in there? Because I, I would be curious to know, are, are they showing the monster that you're excited to see? Or, 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 something else or do you see? feel like you would not have wanted this group to touch your property? Because yeah. Because I'm not attached to it. Yeah. So I don't, it, it doesn't affect me like it would be if they did a Metal Gear Solid game. Yeah. Like if these people made a Metal Gear Solid game, I'd be right out there with my... Give me a movie. You kept saying game. You made game. a movie. Movie, game, whatever. Okay. I would be out there with a picket sign, uh -huh. with my little mask on. Son, I, I'd i be out there. Y'all be like, you coming to work? No, because i got to stop this movie from coming out. 
Um, so I want to know how you're good call. I yeah. want to know how they feel about it. Like, comment, subscribe. Find the bell around us wherever it goes. Ding. Yeah, somewhere. Um, I got a phone call coming. You can find us here on YouTube. You can find us on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, WOTX.com. We out. Peace.